graph the function f of x equals log base one-half of x. We can rewrite this function as y equals log base one-half of x. And so you could then take properties of logarithms and say one-half to the y power equals x because that is the definition of the logarithms. So I'll write that down. One-half raised to the y power equals x. And we could just plot some points here to uh, get a feel of, of what's happening. So let's do that. I've got x and y. And because of the way this is written now as an exponential expression, it's going to be easier to plug in values for y first and then get a corresponding x. So that is, if y is 0, 1 half to the 0 power e equals 1. Anything to the 0 power equals 1. So we have our first point. When x is 1, y is 0. We'll put that right there. If y is 1, 1 half to the y power is 1 half. So when x is 1 half, y is 1. So I'll put that right there. What about when y is 2? 1 half squared equals 1 fourth. All right, so when x is 1 fourth, y is 2. So this is going to shoot up. It's never going to go in the negative x direction. And the reason that that never goes in the negative x direction is because, think of this, we could, we could never get an output, a negative output. No matter what we have as an exponent for y, we will never get a negative output. And you might be thinking, well, what about a negative exponent? Let's try it. Negative 1. Let's write that over to the side here. 1 half raised to the negative 1. The negative exponent means that you take the reciprocal and raise it to the positive exponent. Well, that's just 2 to the first. So when x is 2, y is negative 1. And I'll switch back to green for that. When, when x is 2, y is negative 1. And then what if y is negative 2? Well, we're going to see that that is 1 half raised to the 1 half raised to the negative 2. That equals the reciprocal 2 raised to the positive 2 which equals 4. So we'll put that in. So when x is 4, say that's 2, 3, 4, when x is 4, y is negative 2. So we're going to see this graph just slope down just like this. It'll keep going down forever. It's not going to go drastically, not, not at a steep pace, but it'll steep just keep just going down forever. By the way, you could also think of this as the inverse function, as y equals, if we were to do y equals 1 half to the x, you would, uh, you would graph the, the inverse function there, and it would, it would just come down like like that and if if you can think about inverse functions being um, being a mirror image of of their inverse then you can see that the the red function is a mirror inverse across the line y equals x of the of the original function but but not to confuse the issue here uh, let's just go back to the green the green is the is the graph of the original function f of x equals log base one half of x